y'all. <laughs> Howdy, partner. Hi, hey, hello, what's up? It's me. Welcome back to my channel. I am going to talk about clothes again for around 15 minutes. Something that we should be used to now. I have been liking American Eagle a lot recently, but I do have summer favorites that I think that I will be gravitating towards that I want to share with you guys. So for today's video, we're going to do an American Eagle summer favorites. And I'm super excited. I mean, everybody knows who American Eagle is. They also have their sister company, Aerie. So I do have a couple things from Aerie too, but I just thought I'd compile them all together because you get the gist. Do you know what I mean? Like eyebrows, they're cousins, not sisters. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get on into today's video. We're gonna start off on brand. I've been talking about, well, if you guys haven't seen my garage try on haul, the last video I just uploaded, watch it because I was talking about baby doll dresses. I love a good baby doll dress. To, just to reiterate, <laughs> I live in these. I think every summer I always gravitate towards these. In the winter, they're kind of in the back of my closet. Don't really touch them as soon as the weather breaks. And I'm going for a beach day, pool day, I don't know, something. I always just like throw these little dresses on over my swimsuits because they're just the most comfortable, cutest thing ever. I love them so much. I had this, I've had this dress for years. Honestly, to the point where like, there's a tiny rip in it, but we won't talk about that. Um, I told you, but just keep it a secret. I love this dress. It's so cute. It's floral. It's pink. It's like as girly as any dress could get. And the straps are dainty. It's slightly halter, I guess. I don't know, but it's really cute. You guys will see it on. I love it. I always wear this. I actually, in fact, have worn it twice so far since the weather has gotten really, really hot. I don't know if it's just where I'm at right now, where it's literally boiling, but yeah, it's been really hot. So less clothes, the better, and the more flowy, the better. Love this. So cute. Everyone needs a baby doll dress. Mark my words. How are we feeling that Sabrina Carpenter is our it girl this summer? I'm vibing with espresso. Comment down below if you're a Sabrina Carpenter fan. Anyways, next thing. I don't even know. Cover up? I don't know how to... <laughs> Cardigan? Like, I don't know. It's this thing. <laughs> it's really cute. Honestly, I got this again a few years ago, but this is a favorites video. So I do find myself gravitating towards this in the summer as well. I will say though, last summer, I forgot that I even had this. When I was cleaning up my closet, as one does, I found this again and I completely forgot that I had it. Picture this. I always like to picture something. Like I always need to tell a story. You're in Mexico on the beach or you're at your resort by the pool and you walk up in this cute little number with like, oh my God, I'm picturing an orange bikini. Orange is like, I've been really wanting an orange swimsuit and I don't have one, but I'm just like, I have to get one. So, so cute. I love this so much. It's just like a crochet long open cardigan cover up. I think every girl needs this, especially in the summer. Every girl needs some type of crochet cover up just to, feel cute, look cute, and not feel fully nude. <laughs> because sometimes it's just, it's a little much to walk around in your bikini, no cover up, nothing. At least with this, even though it's filled with a bunch of holes, you still feel a little bit more covered. And I 
it just screams summer to me. This is, I mean, amazing. I don't even know if they even sell it anymore because I've had it for so long, like going on five years, but just speaks to me. It speaks to the boho in me. There was one point in high school where I would wear the baby doll dress, this on top, and a pair of Toms. Let that sink in. Next, article of clothing. This is from Airy, not American Eagle. These biker shorts. If there's one thing that I can rave about when it comes to workout or active wear clothes, these are the best workout shorts that I have ever put on my body, ever. I wear these all year round, quite frankly. I wore them this morning to my workout class. I don't know how they did this. I don't know why these are so good, but they are, because you can just tell they're a pair of basic black biker shorts. <sighs> they, these, <laughs> I don't even know how to explain these because I don't think like I can do it justice. <laughs> First of all, the one thing that I'll point out, there's no seam. There's no front seam on the short and I truly, truly appreciate that because for some reason, the camel and the toe, it's always a problem. With these, it's not. I truly, truly appreciate that because for some reason, the camel and the toe. It's always a problem. These it's not. I truly appreciate a no seamed biker short, but that's not even the best part of it. When I put these on, my body goes from like to this. It just cinches you up in the right places, makes your legs look good, makes your waist look good. It's high waisted. They, I wear these to run, to walk, to jump, everything to squat and these guys don't move like once you put them and adjust them the way that you want them to be whether like lengthwise however they won't move and it's a pet peeve of mine because I do like to run and sometimes it rides up these jump these are amazing I can't rave about these enough and honestly I don't know why I don't have more pairs of these I really don't but Please, any girl out there that is looking for the perfect biker short, please go to Aerie because I have not put anything better on my body. Every time I do laundry, the next day, I always am like, oh my God, where are my biker shorts? Because these are the first pair of shorts that I go to whenever I need to do a workout. Not sponsored, the best. It's moving on. So sticking on brand with the kind of workout theme. Again, I think this is, yeah, this is also airy. By the way, they're both from the offline collection. If that makes a difference, I'm not sure. But next thing I'm going to show you guys is this tank top. Um, I'm a sucker, like I said, we all know for spaghetti straps. Love a good spaghetti strap. This is slightly haltered as well. It has a built-in bra. It is cropped, but I'm one to not love very, very, very cropped things. I'll still wear it because I have so many of them, but my first choice is not necessarily cropped these days. However, for some reason, this is the only tank top anytime I'm just not feeling like I want to wear a bra which is like 95% of the time seriously I'm not kidding I probably wear this like I don't want to <laughs> I don't want to expose myself because it's kind of like is that gross I don't sweat in it I don't wear it to work out it because the girls are too big and it's not like supportive enough 
for me to work out in. But when I'm lounging around, I'm clean. So like, it's not weird to say like three times a week. That's not weird. I change my clothes a lot as well too. So in my defense, I'll wear it for a couple hours a day and then change. I do sometimes wear it to yoga. <laughs> okay, either way, I love this. I think it's like the built-in bra combined with the placement of the straps. I think it looks really flattering on. And I love it. We're boy boy <laughs> We're boycotting bras for the rest of the time, honestly. I don't ever want to think about putting another bra on. I hate them. But built-in bras I truly do appreciate. Thank you, Ari. Last but not least, jean shorts. When I bought them, I was just really like, this was the time when distressed shorts and distressed jeans in general were like the it thing to have. It was really cool to walk around with <laughs> holes in your pants. And I wore these so much. I'm not the biggest fan of distressed anymore, but I do think depending on the vibe that you're trying to give off with your outfit i think this is really cute plus i mean these are so comfortable and they're so lightweight like this denim for some reason it's different i don't know if this is their normal denim maybe it is i haven't actually worn their jeans since high school <laughs> but it's very like thin so even if you're going to the beach or like you just want a really laid back outfit i always gravitate towards like a baggy short and like I don't know I think it just looks super cool and like Converse this was Converse and, like a loose tank I think it's so cool and you look so comfortable so they're a little bit they're not well I, I don't want to say booty shorts but they do cover quite a bit and they're nice I love this wash this is like the perfect denim wash in my opinion I might pack these actually now that I'm looking at them I might bring these with me to the cottage so cute that's it for all of my American Eagle favorites slash airy favorites they're just the things that I genuinely do wear every summer so it's not something that's trendy that'll be out of style soon I think things like that for my wardrobe is just timeless and will be used. So it's definitely worth the investment, even though American Eagle isn't necessarily too crazy in prices, it's still worth it. You're gonna wear it a lot. So comment down below what your favorite article of clothing was. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like this video, of course, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys on Friday. <laughs> Love you all so, so much. Toodles.